good people, good people, good people, good people. Y'all, you ain't gonna believe this. Well, you might, you might believe it. Look, y'all, this dream I had last night was wild. Um, it wasn't as wild as the one I had the night before last, <laughs> but it was pretty wild. Like, to sum it up, people were conspiring against me to get me fired, to make me lose my position, to make me lose the position that I was in. Like, there was a room of people. I was standing outside the door. The door was closed, right? And I could hear them telling the guy in charge, get rid of her. Just let her go. Get rid of her. Y'all need to get... And I'm like, wow. And it's people I'm related to. It's people I've worked with. All, this, this, I'm hearing, right? And it's like I can see through the door, but I can't, right? You know how dreams are. Y'all, I'm in like this little area or whatever. Like, it's like a restaurant slash movie theater <laughs> that I'm at. And um, it's so crazy. And then they like... uh the guy he's like i'm gonna have to let you go i'm like wow bro so you don't let them you you just don't let them convince you to just let me go huh i didn't even do nothing i didn't even do anything to get fired like so i remember i had on a black button down i remember unbutton i was like all right big i'm unbutting my button down big what's as he telling me all right cool i'm leaving so, um, I see one of the girls, and I was like, really, so-and-so, really? Like, that or whatever, she walking out the door there because they had to leave because I guess the movie was over or something. I don't know, but it was so crazy, y'all, because at first I was waitressing. Like, I remember the people to drink order. Like, I had, a, I remember I, was, I had took a party, and then it was like a table up a little bit, up the stairs, and it was a black family. At the head of the table, it was a man, and no, it was a woman, two little girls in between her and the other, and the man, and then on the other side, it was like their grandma, and somebody, it was like four of the people, I can't really remember what they looked like, but I remember, the lady ordered a lemonade, she ordered two waters, <laughs> and the guy had ordered, I was getting ready to take his order, and that's when they had like called me or whatever, and then they was like, we already done transferred your table to somebody, I'm like, damn, for real? Y'all done already transferred my table over? I just got the people, I ain't even got their drinks yet. But I remember writing it down. I remember seeing it on the napkin. I wrote it down. It was an L. I remember seeing the W, the W, and everything. And um, before that, though, you guys, there I was. I was going, and I didn't quite know where I was. But I opened up a door. The door was unlocked. I opened it, and it was this big bright light. And so I heard and closed it because it was the theater, right? So then I walked up a little bit. And I'm trying to find, I guess, like the kitchen or wherever. I opened up this other door. This other door was unlocked. I opened it right on up. There was another big bright light. And um, so then it was another door. I, as I went up, I said, okay, this ain't it. It was another door. I walked in, opened that door or whatever. It was, an, it was another bright light. These people were mad that I had opened the doors and let the light in. Do y'all hear what I'm saying? They were mad that the doors were open. The doors were already open. I just had to twist the knob and open it. Right? They were unlocked. I just had to open the door. They were mad that I had let the light in, y'all. The people were sitting in darkness. Do y'all hear what I'm saying? Do you hear what I am saying? The people were sitting in darkness. And they were mad that I had let the light in. And they got rid of me for that. <laughs> y'all, some people are going to be mad at the light that you shine in, that you let in. But this little light of mine, <laughs> I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Listen, shine, shine, shine. <laughs> y'all, they was mad, y'all. They were mad. This dream was wild, and I'm just like, wow. And so I was hurt, y'all. I was hurt by this job firing me, making me leave. So I go and I'm talking to my stepdad or whatever. I'm crying. I think I was crying. I was, I was like, yeah. I'm going to sue them because they, they didn't fire me for no reason. They conspired against me and everything. He was like, yeah, baby. <laughs> Lord, but y'all, sometimes your, your light is so bright, people can't handle it. But don't you dim your light. 
don't dim your light okay you keep shining because you are lighting the way for others to see and it was so many men it was so many meetings that i got from this dream that i had this morning you guys like there are doors that are already waiting for you to open these doors are already unlocked they are just waiting for you to walk up and just open it there was three doors you guys it was three doors and i'm just excited because i feel like god is opening doors it's open door season it's open door season <laughs> god you open up a window and i'm walking through i'm gonna climb through that window listen it's open door season <laughs> that's all i came to tell y'all i wanted to share that with y'all because it's it really touched me this morning like i was i was hurt by the people that conspired against me and stuff in the dream but through it all overall it's a blessing because let me tell you something sometimes look let me just say this that door closed there was a door closing right with with the employer that i had in my dream with the employer that i initially had in my dream that door had to close right they let me go listen they let, they let me go okay they let me go in the dream they let me go from that little restaurant y'all they conspired against me they they look they they took a vote they did something they 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 got me out of there but god had already opened up three other doors for me to walk through because he already knew that that door was closing y'all hear y'all hear what i'm saying do y'all hear what i'm saying baby just walk on out like Mary Mary say, I'm walking, I'm walking, I'm walking. Listen, I'm walking. I, I walked out the doors. Because I know God going to open up another door. So when one door closes and another one opens, but it's already doors that are unlocked waiting for you to open, okay? So this message is for somebody, all right? I don't know who it's for, but just know that whatever it is, it's a blessing in disguise. Somebody could lose their job. Somebody could get fired. You might walk out of your job. You might say, you know what? <laughs> I'm done. You gonna throw your hands up and say I'm done. So what? Okay, listen. God is opening doors. Okay, it's open door season, honey. It's time to walk through those doors. This is your season. This is your harvest season. This is your winning season. The worst part's over. It's time for you to receive. It's time for you to receive those blessings. It's time for you to walk through that door and let your light shine. And this is the word that I have for you guys. I hope that it really helps, okay? Remember to love yourself. Be kind to yourself and others, all right? Stay popping by being positive on purpose. Y'all know how you go pop your collar. You hear me? <laughs> I love y'all. If you don't do nothing else, stay dope by dishing out positive energy, okay? If you don't do nothing else, dream big. Wake up. Do it. I love y'all.